Clark, seven strikeouts in four and a third innings. How are you feeling about that conclusion to your spring training camp? Feeling really good. You know, uh, I thought, you know, strike percentage was really high today, kind of attacking guys. Um, obviously, being able to get the put away pitches and, and get swing and miss. A, a lot of swing and miss today, which I was really happy about. Um, and just continue to build that workload up a, a little bit towards the, that last thing in there. Started losing a little gas, but that's part of building it up out there and, um, you know, getting past that threshold of, you know, building the pitch count up. So I was really happy with today. We've seen that cutter quite a bit this camp. How are you feeling about the development of that and what kind of weapon do you think it'll be during the regular season? Yeah, I thought today it was the best day of it, you know, so far this camp. I think I had a, you know, the shape wise was really, really good. Um, I had a lot of swing and misses on it to lefties and, and actually a lot of swing and misses on it to righties as well. So, um, you know, it's really exciting, especially with the strike percentage of it and, and the swing and miss of it. Um, you know, it's, it's going to be a big pitch for me and, you know, I'm excited about it. As you head into the regular season, it looks like you're lined up now potentially for the number two mm -hmm. spot following Garrett Cole there in that, the Giants series. What kind of opportunity do you think that is for you? Yeah, I mean, it's, it's an unbelievable opportunity. You know, coming into spring training, like, you know, I was fighting for the five spot and, you know, sometimes injuries happen and, and you look up and you're, now you're fighting in the, you're in the two spot. So um, obviously I'm, I'm very grateful for the opportunity and, um, you know, it's, it, you know, it's exciting times. You know, I, I've worked my whole life for stuff like this and to be able to have that opportunity is um, something I'm excited for. Just continue to be myself and go out there and get outs and, and help the team win in any way I can. Anthony Volpe named the opening day shortstop. He'll be behind you probably in that uh, second game of the regular season. He made a couple nice plays today too. What do you think about Volpe making this squad? Yeah, I think it, I'm so excited for him. He's such a good kid. He's He's got a good head on his shoulders and um, you see, I mean, his defense is amazing. You know, he's got th that glove. You know, today he was making plays behind me and he's been doing it all camp. You know, he, he came in here and he had an opportunity to compete for a spot and he, he took it wholeheartedly and um, he kept his head down the whole time and competed and, and had a lot of success. So uh, I think he's going to be a very, very good player. Um, I think he's going to have a really long career um, and I'm just excited to see how it all plays out. I think he's a hard worker and he's got a good head on his shoulders. So it, it's a lot of fun playing, behind, playing in front of him, I guess. <laughs> A couple of hours from now, you guys are getting on the plane. You're heading north. You've got to stop in D.C., but soon it's going to be Yankee Stadium yep. opening day. How are you feeling as you head north? Yeah, we're excited. I think, um, you know, like you said, one last stop, um, get that exhibition game in, and then it's, it's full bore back to the season and, and getting up in New York. And uh, I know everybody's excited here, and I know the, the city's excited, I'm sure, and just being able to get back up there and that, that energy in the Bronx, we can't wait, man. So um, exciting times for sure, and we can't wait. Clark, thank you for the time. Yes, sir. Thank you.